Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned. We'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Point and attack today is Alexis Sanchez. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goals. Neymar plays with Lionel Messi. And the game begins. He's showing a real will to win the ball. They're really pressing their opponents. Well, nicely cut out. The ball. Very good reading of the game to win possession back. Lionel Messi. Neymar. Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. Valentin Rogier. And the keeper with the ball. Klaus. Went in strongly to win the ball. Struggling to get it away. And a time for calm on the ball. The ball back with PSG now. Chance to do damage. And he takes on the shot. The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. Messi. And quite simply, wide of the target. Valentin Rogier. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. A gift for any goalkeeper. Marquinhos Beautifully weighted ball Oh, there's the goal! There's the opener! How about that? Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? So, underway again here. One nil the score. It is a decent looking attack here. A chance to whip it in. Not all that convincing defensively. Well, no damage done. Well, Marseille just can't dominate the possession, but what they've done with it has been really good. And they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment. They love to play on the counter attack. Alert defending. Fabian 
And it took a touch on the way through, so a corner here. Over it comes. Will it be? Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Great pressure to... In position. He can't hold on to it. Well, quite simply, the cross was too close to the keeper. Alexis Sanchez. Oh, in with a chance. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. And Marseille regaining possession. And threading it forward. And the cross has promise. And turned onto the woodwork. Taking care of business defensively here. And that is that for the first half here in the French capital. Second half underway then. Marseille have the lead, but I'll tell you what, it's a long way from being settled. Danilo Pereira. This is Sergio Ramos. Good pressure high up the pitch. An unforced error, you've got to say. And the referee blows for a foul. And they deal with the threat this time. And the flag is up. Offside. Well, that's just the lack of awareness. He was clearly in an offside position. Danilo Pereira. Neymar. Neymar. Still alive. Sound piece of goalkeeping. And you don't want to lose possession there. Well denied by the keeper, but really he only has himself to blame. Well, a good tackle. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Oh, and that challenge carried with it quite the element of risk. Now, what's the referee going to do next? PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. And the red card has been shown, and that puts a bit of a stain on things. Well, they're in a great position, but that could change everything. It's a thoughtless challenge. Ramos Marquinhos Now do they mean business on this occasion? Hakimi And Fabian Working really well as a team to regain possession Fabian, and a decent delivery, very much a run of the mill as saves go, and the danger still on, and the referee has awarded the free kick, he tried to play advantage, but it wasn't forthcoming, substitution it is for PSG. PSG doing well to win it back. That is tackling of the highest order. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Hakimi. 
He could pick out a teammate. Opportunity! And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. That's a very impressive piece of defending. And in with a real chance. And it's come off the keeper. Well, nothing comes of it. Defensive efficiency personified. Can they put it away? And he's lost custody of the ball here. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Well, this late corner could represent their last chance to equalise. Can he put it away? Oh, a goal to level it up in the closing stages. Who's going to claim the trophy? It's an open question here. Well, this deserves another look. It's a really well-rehearsed set-play routine. The delivery is inch-perfect, and what a great finish it is. Struck with power and accuracy, certainly no stopping that. So, back on the way. One goal apiece here. PSG on the attack as the minutes tick away. What can they do in the closing phase? So two minutes to be added on at the end. Now he must favour the cross. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. That is that after 90 minutes. They are level and extra time is coming up. Well, the ball rolling again here, the first period of extra time, and you've got to wonder to what extent fatigue will play a part in this now. It's been an extremely competitive 90 minutes. Attacking possibilities for PSG, but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Soler. And Marseille with the ball once more. Counter-attacking very much an option. Well, it petered out. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Determined defending. Happy to take on the shot. I'm not testing the keeper at all with that effort. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle. And the referee has got to book him, I think. And yellow it is. A booking? Yeah, he was too impatient to win the ball and probably deserved a yellow card. to the woodwork oh great attacking play well as he hit that one it looked as though it had a chance <laughs> really closing him down strong but fair tackle Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? And the first period of extra time. And so, 15 more minutes. We're into the second period of extra time here. A very good tackle. Oh, a nice looking pass. It was a menacing attack, but tidied up. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Chances on. Oh, the goal! Who would have predicted this after the sending off? They have the lead now. Incredible. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. 
It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. And that is going to be a free kick. And opting for the lenient approach, the referee, rather than cautioning him. No worries for the keeper. Well, five minutes remaining in this, the second period of extra time. Well, they might be onto something. On his own with only the keeper to beat, but he's missed it, Stuart. Well, he went for power, but he didn't make the perfect connection. That's why he's missed the target there. Danilo Pereira. And if you're wondering about added time, two minutes it'll be. What a pass that lacks quality. Oh, and a perfect ball now. How about this? And he's through. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Four marks to the entire team. And now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.